about that time now for the buzz. And this morning we are cruising with Miss Courtney. That's right. We took a trip up to Tomball to check out Tejas Chocolate Craftery. But don't let the name fool you. They sell much more than just chocolate. And less than 20 minutes away in spring, we got to interact with dozens of exotic animals at a local wildlife park. Pork belly is going in here for the afternoon cook, and they're sizzling and smoking. There are thousands of barbecue restaurants in Texas, but not many of them got their start as a chocolate shop. There really wasn't quite enough revenue on its own to make a living, so we needed added uh, to make a business out, we need to add food, and we decided it had to be barbecue. So Scott Moore Jr. renovated the oldest building in Tomball and opened Tejas Chocolate Craftery in 2015. It's vibrant, uh, it's noisy. Uh, a lot of great aromas. You have barbecue smoke, chocolate aromas all melding together. So it's a fun place to be. Just two years after opening their doors, they're ranked the sixth best barbecue joint in the state by Texas Monthly Magazine. The barbecue was great. It was top notch. And, and the great thing about it is they're always willing to experiment with new things, you know, uh, whether it's their beer brats or pastrami beef rib or their Reuben sandwiches. Uh, just outstanding barbecue overall. Brisket is their best seller. So these are all briskets for tomorrow. And don't even think about leaving without a hand rolled chocolate truffle. After a big barbecue meal, a refreshing bite of chocolate is a perfect capper. You're likely going to need to walk off a meal like that, so why not take a walk in the wild? Hi, you. TGR Exotics Hi. is just a short drive away this in spring and started with just one animal. His first Christmas, we got a pot belly pig, and that's what it started with because back in the day, it was like going to buy a nice dog, and you went to all these. Uh, exotic game ranches um, and they had all these amazing animals that she never saw. Gwen Scott never knew a Christmas present for her son would eventually lead her family to operating a wildlife park. You'll have the chance to be up close and personal with about a hundred different animals. She is a scavenger so she hasn't she's not a predator she's not gonna hunt us and eat us. From a water buffalo named Buffy <laughs> to porcupines and primates these exotic animals are well worth the cruise down Highway 6. In Harris County, Courtney Burris, News 3. Cruising with Courtney, sponsored by RV Source. Those animals, we were all like, wait, what? A hyena? And, you know. Some really interesting ones. You, know, yeah. you go to the zoo and, you know, they're in cages. You maybe get to a little read about them. But this woman will take you around. I learned so much. Yeah. Kind of get to get up, up close and personal. And, and certainly animals you don't see uh, every day. Those so that otters, was a lot of fun. Those otters got up close and personal with, really it, with our camera. They were yes. some cute little guys there. Uh, Max is very, really interested in the barbecue. Of course. The barbecue and chocolate smell at the same time, that sounds magical. incredible. That's yeah. It was magical. But uh, all of those on that top 50 list, they, they sell out really quick. Right. So if you do want to get there, Courtney didn't even get a chance to try the barbecue there. Yeah, we got there. there at 2. They just opened at 11, and it was, go it was, it was all gone. gone. Yeah. So, so uh, really definitely. Uh, thanks, Courtney. That was yeah. some good stuff there. Got to get there quick. Let's answer yesterday's trivia question.